Hello everyone, uh, this is my first video here and it is Monday, July 8th, around 12.20 and uh, we're gonna report the health of these trees. So let's start off with this one right here. So what you're seeing here is a green buttonwood. It's a little um, deep, as you can see right there. Let's look at this. Yeah, do like a little ring maybe here. And uh, when you plant a tree, you also want to expose the first root flare. So something like this. That would be the first um, In more flare. videos, I guess I'll have more tools out here while I'm doing this. I don't know. So here's a root here. So yeah, you can move up the canopy here. Look at the trunk. It's nice trunk. Straight trunk. Nice. Yeah. Got some... Yeah. Now you see that, how it's just exposed like this. Yeah. It's our leg. A lot of people in South Florida, they think these, these type of pruning cuts are good for the tree because they think that you can expose it and air would just go right through it for hurricane season. Yeah, that's not good. Because what happens is you have this long lagging and then you have bushes over here. And so what happens is this flows in the wind. There's nothing here. There's nothing there. And then this, all of this, the air is being compressed out of it. And then what? It will snap. You want to train your trees um, when they're young want to train them while they're young. Look at this, look at this, look at this. So again, it's going around basically at parks and uh, filming trees. Seeing some health conditions and to hire a company to pruning. trim your trees. You should always hire an ISA certified arborist check your city codes i know that in miami beach uh only isa certified arborists can prune trees now look at this this is a nice little specimen a nice little thing you can work on Trim a little bit um, here and there you know open up that canopy just a little bit i know i spoke about uh opening it up but there is a way to open it up you see how that limb right there is just see that right there this right here, this right here, can prune it, you know, structurally prune it. Structurally prune that, see it's right here. You can remove all of this, leave it, remove this little bit, you know, look at that. Boom, trim this, structural it. So there you go. go. Let's see a collar right here. Let's see if we could find the collar here. So here is a collar. So you wanna cut right along that line right there right along See that, that line. there was a cut before a limb right here they cut it nicely and it's sealed up really nice good cut there see another cut right here that's a good cut see it right here oh, all suckers all right so yeah man there we have it this is my first video um see there's the corporates right there I don't know if they're the ones that trim this though, so I'm, I'm not even gonna get into man, and uh, do some reduction cuts up over here so that you don't have all of these, you know, co-dominant leaders coming up from one trunk. Look at all of this, man. Yeah, you wanna trim some of this down, hit it up so that these guys don't get as chunky because if you leave them, look, hey, look, here's a nice cut. See that, look at that. And that would have been a nice little tree. Um, there is still hope for this. It's still young. 
slowly start trying you it, as the tree shapes up you will know which one to remove but yeah it's a little hard because what you don't want is to have this going on right and then uh, look at this let me see that you don't want this to start going on there's already some kind of decay happening here we have um, some kind of termites ants, and then this will split right here at some point you know once this gets top heavy once this guy right here gets heavy enough it's gonna split here hey yeah guys this is my first video on youtube tree health reporter in the house again i am not a certified arborist i am certified uh, horticultural professional, uh, landscape uh, inspector, years of pruning experience, landscape experience. So yeah, man, we're at, uh, I believe this is called Pride Park in Miami Beach. This is right across the street from the convention center. Yeah, I want you to check this out right here. This is a nice tree, right? It looks good. So you can actually do, so it's leaning this way, right? You could do some reduction cuts here. Get rid of this guy right here. So okay, now it will look like that. See, it will look like this. So now it will start going this way. So you want to remove this guy right here, right? Remove this guy up here. And uh, yeah, allow it to grow just a little bit. Not too what much you don't want is for times. this guy to be so top heavy that it will snap. And this is a weak uh, like type tree. Ooh, I like that. It's a weak tree. Uh, this is a tab. I believe it's a yellow tab. Yep, this is a yellow Get tab. The, uh, see? See the uh, termite type things happening there? When you're trimming, at least that's how I do it. So there's the convention center. So this is right across the street from the convention center. For me, it's called Pride Park. And over there, that's the botanical garden. Um, Usually down south, down in Kendall. But now they're starting to show up up here. Yes. See that? Do some nice little trimming on the bottom right over here. Clear this up so it can match the top. Let it grow out as it should. And yeah. All right, guys. Well, this is my first video here. So let's see what happens. 